The Chairman of the House of Representatives Committee on Justice, Honorable Olamide Oshoba, has or is recommending safety measures for the well-being of children on the internet. Honorable Oshoba said this while declaring open a public hearing on the bill for an act to provide for enactment of Child Online Access Protection Bill 2023 and other issues of online violence against the Nigerian child and other related matters at the National Assembly Complex. The bill also urges parents and educators to do everything possible to protect their child from falling prey to internet pedophiles. The bill will serve as a comprehensive framework to counter the many threats to our children. The bill includes measures to establish strict criteria for age verification on social media platforms, ensuring that children cannot access age inappropriate content. It also mandates schools and educational institutions to incorporate digital literacy and on online safety education into their curriculum, empowering our children with the knowledge and skills to navigate the internet world. Furthermore, the bill calls for stringent penalties for individuals found guilty of penetrating, perpetrating online violence against children. We must send a strong message to those who prey on our vulnerable children and their actions will not go unpunished. Representative of the Speaker, Usman Belo Kumo, says the bill, being straightforward, must be passed for the future of children in the country. The digitalization of the child online issue cannot be overemphasized because we are in a digital world. And Nigeria, as one member of the Committee of Nations, cannot live in isolation. And therefore, we must key in into the global best practice. And our children must not be exposed to an extent where some people take advantage of them in abusing their rights and their privileges. So the bill happens to be a collaborative bill and function between the children, parents, uh, service providers, and government to ensure that as a society, as a responsible and responsive society, we must do the right thing. Stakeholders also noted that the safety and well-being of Nigerian child in this digital age should be of utmost priority to everyone. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.